Okay, my dear Aries, what's up with you all? Hope you all are doing fantastic, mind blowing. This is Luna, the Moon Tarot. Let's see what is it that your person's current thoughts and feelings are today towards you. This is for my dear Aries. What are your person's current thoughts and feelings towards my dear Aries, please? Do remember that time is fluid, energies can be interchangeable. And if it is not resonating with you, it may resonate with your partner. And if it doesn't resonate at all, do check out your Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus and Jupiter signs as well. Right? So let's see. This is for my dear Aries. What are your person's current thoughts and feelings, please? This is for my dear Aries. The first card that came out is somebody who's not taking an action. Somebody who is feeling very indecisive. The entire connection uh, seems to be put on hold. There is no forward movement. There is no improvement. Everything is see, uh, looking very stuck. With 10 of uh, swords and 4 of wands here, I feel that there is something to do with marriage. Either you guys are married and there has been some sort of um, betrayal, some sort of hurt, some sort of uh, backstabbing and there is a lot of pain that one person is carrying in this particular connection. In case if you're not married, then I see that, you know, you're looking forward for, uh, you were looking forward for your person to commit to you, to be in a higher level of commitment and your, either you or your person did not went ahead with the commitment and right now everything is standstill and the other person is feeling betrayed in this particular connection what else okay there are two cards that flew out let me quickly get it up. all right so two cards that came out is the magician and nine of cups here that tells me that you are manifesting hard or your person is right now manifesting very hard for this connection to be successful there is some amount of emotional codependency that either you have in this connection towards your person or your person has towards you that can be a blockage or a challenge here uh, for few of you i see that your person may even have some sort of addiction issues in this particular connection which is again uh, is a blockage in this particular connection uh, a challenge in this particular connection but one of you is manifesting really hard for this connection to work. There is a lot of positivity. There is a lot of affirmations. There, uh, there is a lot of uh, manifestation which is going or working uh, in the background. Probably you are manifesting, your person is manifesting and there's a lot of hard work uh, that um, you are putting in in this particular connection or your person is thinking that they are putting in this particular connection to make it happen. But definitely there is a standstill. Uh, you know things are not moving ahead there is no further action which is which has been which is being taken in this particular connection because i think either you want a relationship a commitment um, okay or you want marriage out of this connection if you're already in a relationship right with high priestess i see that you may be consulting tarot readers you may be consulting psychics you may be cons uh, watching tarot readers online as well but there is a divine timing which is at play in this particular connection the high priestess tells me that there are few hidden secrets as well in this connection which with time you or your person will get to know right ten of cups yet again everything uh, uh, in this particular connection right now i feel is uh something to do with uh, long term something to do with marriage something to do with high level of commitment something to do with having a family and a, a stable life in this particular connection so that is something that is uh, there on the cards that i see right now right oh uh, one second let me just pull out the golden okay yeah better so that is something that i see that there is something to do with the commitment here there can be some commitment issues that one person is trying to get a commitment and the other person is kind of not ready and the other and uh, because of which the other person is feeling betrayed overburdened you know there can be a situation wherein you uh, you know you want or your person wants to be in a stable relationship it can be a child it can be something which started with friendship and turned into a romantic uh, relationship and it is also a possibility that you know probably there is some uh, past influence as well in one of yours life that you know the past relationship or the past person is still intervening or somebody still in touch or in connection with uh, your past exes right so that is also becoming uh overburdening and overwhelming for the other person but 10 of wands i also see that somewhere down the line um you know uh it is
there is this particular connection or probably the x interference is becoming overburdening in this particular connection right with six of cups i also see that uh, you want to go ahead and exchange the cup of love or you are expecting your person to come towards you give you a commitment and be all that lovey-dovey in this particular connection but the fact is that they are not taking any action right and all of a sudden this particular situation is becoming overwhelming and overburdening here right they are not taking any action i see that uh, either you or your person is feeling very directionless very stuck and you are also thinking what is it that i need to do in this particular connection now right aries so that's about it uh, uh, for today i will see you in the next video which is tomorrow Till then, do like, share, subscribe to my channel, right?